Hello everyone and welcome to SOLIDWORKS training session. In today's video, we are going to use the commands of lofted boss base and the shell command to make a beautiful vase which you can see here. So let's get started. Now click on file and select new. Now here you will have a part option. So select on that. By clicking on that you will be opening a new uh, window in which you can make your uh, drawings in 3D models. So alright, select top plane first. Make reference geometry to that plane. Now we will be requiring around 4 planes. So the first plane will be uh, around 50 mm in distance. Alright, and we will just increase the number of planes to 4 so we will get 4 uh, parallel planes which are equally spaced at 50 mm to each other but that's it click ok we are going to uh, make sketch in the first plane so the first plane the first sketch will be a circle at the origin which will be having a dimension of uh, around uh, yeah 50 mm that's good that's that's absolutely great and then exit the sketch now take the second plane and start sketching on it make the plane normal by clicking on control 8 and then make another circle now this circle will have a diameter of 90 mm right so 90 mm. then then exit sketch again click on the third plane sketch and the plane make normal to you can also make it from here yeah like this then the third circle will be of the dimension yeah it will be a 40 mm okay then, then comes the fourth circle, which will be on plane 4, start sketching, make the plane normal, the fourth circle will be, it will be again of 60 mm, alright, so 60 mm is the final circle, now, let's hide uh, all the planes so that we can only see the uh, I mean the sketches alright so exit the sketch now these circles are ready and uh, this uh, things are ready to become a beautiful vase so before that what we are going to do is we are going to edit some of the plane distances so plane 2 we will keep at 120 mm then the plane 3 will be at uh, mm, a distance of 190 mm alright bit further and then plane 4 will be at a distance of 230 mm alright so let's get the lofted pause space command now this is selecting the first uh, sketch then select the second sketch and then the third sketch and the last fourth sketch all right so this is it guys so now you can actually vary how do you like to have this thing okay if you want it to be twisted a bit you can you can actually have you go about this okay so more of the bars will be like this absolutely right so you can also twist this you can make it more rounder more rounder and rounder yeah now we are actually making the vase and giving it a proper shape alright so I think this will uh, work so now now this uh, is a solid but what we have to do is we have to make a shell the shell on the top face and uh, make it around 
और फाइव एम एम हाउ यू कैन एज यू कैन सी कॉट दिस हॉलो स्पेस इन साइड एंड द बास इज परफेक्टली रेडी बट बिफोर इट लेट्स गिव फिल इट एट द टॉप एंड बॉटम सर्फेसिस सो दैट इट लुक्स मोर ब्यूटिफुल एंड द एस्थेटिक्स ऑफ इट्स आर वेल इनवर्स ओके सो यू हैव गिवन एन एच फिल इट इन साइड एंड देन वील ऑल्सो गिव एच फिल इट आउटसाइड Okay, so it has not been selected. Edge fillet outside and edge fillet inside. Okay, and also edge fillet at the bottom. Right, so can increase it by two mm. Good. So the filleting is complete. Now the final step is the step is giving it a, a nice and a, a shiny color. So I am giving a plastic. in a high gloss colors uh, i am actually using a nice medium gloss colors cheeky and gloss colors yeah red medium gloss no i actually want a shiny color okay so I, i'll go in the high gloss so somewhere will be my color yeah this is red high gloss first i will i will select what all i want to color so this is all the things i want to color and then Give it a nice so so the vase can be like this yeah so again selecting them and print uh, okay thanks a lot guys thank you for watching this video and I hope you like this video and please share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel that's it for this video I will see you all in the next one.